This is how Andre Onana is already impressing Manchester United teammates in training on US tour. Man United have a new number one after signing Andre Onana and he is catching the eye with his performances in training in America. Eric Ten Hag is set to double down on playing out from the back this season with Andre Onana already impressing his teammates with his ability with his feet. The 27-year-old is renowned for his passing and it's that footwork that convinced Ten Hag to push for a reunion with his former Ajax goalkeeper, paying into £44 million to make him the club's new number one. Onana trained with his new teammates a few times at United's Pingree School training base in New Jersey and he warmed up with the rest of the squad at the MetLife Stadium on Saturday, but was not in the squad for the 2-0 win against Arsenal. He's likely to make his debut against Real Madrid in Houston on Wednesday, but with the training base moving on to San Diego on Sunday he is already showing what he can do with his feet, with veteran goalkeeper Tom Heaton already seeing why Ten Hag wanted Onana. I can see already how he's going to fit into the manager's style, he looks really good with his feet and I am already picking up a little bit up about how he does things slightly differently to what I've seen before, he said. I know I'm getting on but I still try to adapt, still try to learn all the time. I enjoy that side of it and we will see what he brings in. Onana played 145 times under Ten Hag for Ajax but had just one year at Inter after joining the club on a free transfer. He had an excellent campaign in last season's Champions League, playing very well in the final against Manchester City and earning the praise of Pep Guardiola. I've not seen a massive amount of him if I'm totally honest, I saw the Champions League final and seen bits and bobs, said Heaton. In the Premier League we've got Edison and Alisson and they've changed that goalkeeping side a little bit, most teams play that way now, Onana has come into us now, time will tell. I think Pep said it was difficult for them to get on a high press on with him playing like that. I was really impressed with him in that game and I'm looking forward to working with him, competing with him and we'll see how it plays out. David De Gea struggled to implement Ten Hag's desire to play out from the back last season and that was part of the reason the Spaniard was eventually allowed to depart the club when his contract expired. Heaton believes the early signs in training are that Ten Hag plans to go even further this year with his attempts to get United to play out from the goalkeeper. The first goal against Arsenal came from a Heaton pass to Kobe Mainu and Ten Hag turned to his goalkeeper to praise him for the approach during the celebrations. I think the way he wants to play we're all adapting to a bit. We were last season and this season and this season he wants to take it on again, he said. It's been good, we want to build from the back, if that's not on one of the options is going longer. Onana has come in to replace De Gea as the club's first choice goalkeeper, but there is still uncertainty within the group. Dean Henderson is in the United States but hasn't played as he eases his way back from a thigh injury and is the subject of interest from Nottingham Forest, with a move likely. Heaton had the option taken on his contract, but the 37-year-old was wanted by Premier League newcomers Luton Town and after three appearances in two years since his return to Old Trafford, he is desperate to play more regularly before the curtain comes down on his career. He intends to speak to Ten Hag at some point during the summer when the picture within the group becomes clearer, but after playing the full 90 minutes in the 2-0 win against Arsenal at the MetLife Stadium, it has only reinforced a desire to play more often, especially with the clock ticking on his career. Asked if his age made the desire to play even greater, Heaton said, yes I think is the honest answer, the two games I played last season, I really enjoyed it and it adds to the appetite, I'm still hungry to play. There's still that drive to play. I got the opportunity to play against Arsenal, a strong Arsenal at the MetLife Stadium, you want to take that on. It's not feeling, that energy in your body that you miss and I do miss it if I'm honest. I love it here. I have been part of this football club for a long time, but I also love playing. I can't lie, you see it today so I will have a sit down and chat and see where we go. Ten Hag would be reluctant to lose Heaton's experience, with the former England international part of the leadership group last season, a role he enjoyed despite his lack of playing time on the pitch. I'm a senior player, I've been a football player for a long time, I was at this football club before and came back, he said. We have got plenty of leaders in our dressing room and get together if things need addressing or sorting or talking to the manager, just general things really. With this football club, sometimes things can get blown out of proportion and highlighted but it's just the day-to-day -day running of how things go. The expectations. This club sets the highest possible standards and you look to the leadership group to set those standards really. I was part of that last season and I would hope to be going forward as well, the manager put it together really, he organises that, don't forget to subscribe to this platform, if you are fans of Manchester United, see you to the next updates.